feel slimy. Yeah. The Yucksters, Yucksters Project Project Paint. Paint. Yuck! Hey friends, it's me, Sean. And Lucita. And, and we're, we're the Yucksters! Yucksters. Spoiler alert. Today, we're going to make messy masterpieces with mud paint. Whoa. Yes, we're going to be yucky artists and we're going to show you how to do this at home. To start, ask a grown-up to get a few supplies. Water, food coloring, paint brushes, some disposable containers, and last but not least, dirt. Here's how you make mud paint. First, you mix water and dirt to make mud. Let's see what happens if you add more water to the mud. It becomes so watery, like a mud puddle. But what do you think will happen if we add a lot more dirt? Yep, the mud gets thick, like a really dirty, chocolatey mud pudding. Ew! Once you have the mud a consistency you like, add a few drops of food coloring to make different colors. And ta-da! Let's get into it! We're using cardboard boxes as our canvas, but you could use paper if you wanted. If you don't have paint brushes and you want to get extra messy, you can paint with your hands. Let's get yucky! about mud painting was that it was way more messy than I thought. The coolest thing I observed was that the paint changed color as it dried. We give Project Mud Paint a yuck factor of 10. 10. Thanks for hanging yucky with us today. See you next time. Wait a second, where are you going? Subscribe to get the newest videos from Sesame Studios. You wanna watch more? Click here. Today we're gonna make some sticky stuff called oobleck. It's the ultimate slime. Oobleck is weird, goopy stuff. It could act harder or softer depending on how you use it.